Hey everyone, Solar Primal here. Welcome back to Let's Play Twilight Princess. In the last part, well, lots of things. So, in this part though, we are going to be facing off against the boss. So without any further ado, let's jump right in. And it should be no surprise who the boss is for this dungeon. That's right. It's a giant oak elf. No, that, that would be terrifying. Okay, so let's not joke about that. Ugh. Anywho. No, it... I couldn't guess it by now. The actual boss. Oh. The game does that to us. Introducing more mechanics right before a boss fight. It's cool, it's cool. It's how they want to roll. It's fine by me. But yeah. Remember that little thing that we saw? It's not really little. A bit of a big thing we saw. The beginning here. Yeah. It likes to break things. That's right, we're fighting Link. Just kidding. Wait for it. Yeah, there he is. Another dragon. I actually wonder where these dragons come from. Mind you, dragons have always kind of been a thing in the Legend of Zelda universe. Yeah. He sounds just as annoying as the rest of them. Now, what's his little gimmick this time around? Well. Sure as heck needs to start using this double claw shot. I don't know what the heck I was about to pick up there. Yeah, oh, come on motion controls. Not a time for you to be being all goofy on me. So yeah, you just pick a side basically. Or... I think this is what you're supposed to do. I could be totally wrong. I'm gonna try and claw shot onto his little hook thing. I think. It's gotta be. Oh, right. Use those iron boots. Weigh him down. He's not crazy about that. Oh, I sound that armor fell off. Fair enough. He's yeah, I'm still wearing Alright, that's cool. But you get the idea of what you're supposed to do. Right? Or do I have to show you again? <laughs> no. I joke when I say that because I have to do this again anyways. It's almost make it sound like... I don't know. Hey buddy. Why don't you come on over? Got a nice crotch shot of Link there. But yeah. Get on his tail, put on those iron boots and... Knock some more of that armor off. Ooh, something's a little bit more exposed now. Yeah, it's blinking at us. Oh no, I think that thing senses it. Oh, he's not cool about that. It's brain on the thunder. Oh, he's like, screw the armor, haha, -ha. I have the brain on my side. Does that not work if you breathe fire? You know what? I ain't gonna argue it. What I am gonna argue is this mechanic. Because I hate this. I hate it so much, I don't want it to be a thing. Yeah, he's raising this game alright. Literally forcing us to traverse once again up here so we can get to those walnuts I think they're called I call them floaty babas or something I don't know I'm just original that way am I close to one yet? yep So he doesn't have the little chandelier on him now. 
which sucks. Now we have to try and figure out a way onto him. I don't remember how we're supposed to figure our way out to him. I really don't remember. Oh, there we go. No. No. Our, like, only opportunity to get on there is it's being delayed by that. Yeah, this music's back. Awesome. Can Link ride a dragon one day, please? That would be amazing. Like, right now. Wee, the wind. And that's mildly funny, I'm saying we because it's on the plane is on the we. Sounds like a game. We the wind. Uh oh. That's not good. Oh dear. This is bad. Okay, good. He didn't make an attempt at my life. Much obliged, buddy. I'm gonna wait for you to get up here and uh just gotta somehow get behind them. This is the dumbest part of this fight here is basically at the mercy of oh, here we go. Stop moving. Just gotta get over to him. And back to the triumphal music. It just sucks if like we went through all this trouble climbing all the way up, and then just to have him... Oof. Uh, he really commands that wind. Um, for him just to knock you down, you have to climb up all the way back. Alright. See if he's gonna make this a little trickier this time. He's trying. He wants to murder me. Oh, jeez, that was close. You can see that mid-flight just being like... What you want to do, buddy? I'm just hanging out here. There you go. Get all riled up and want to blow fire. He's much faster now, though, so I gotta... I think I really move. I'm surprised these walnuts aren't getting burnt. Oh. Yeah, he's been smart this time. You know, he's really close by me. Instead of settling somewhere, he's definitely trying to... Oh, that's my opportunity right there. Come on. No. There we go. One last bout, shall we, buddy? Let's go. Yeah. Did it. Go back killing a dragon. I think dragons are cool. But from the looks of it, killing dragons is a normal thing in Hyrule. Yeah, that's why there's not so many of them. Aww. We're still on his back, by the way. I think. Nope. Okay, we jumped off early. That was actually smart. I would have still been on his back. It's just me. That probably would have ended very badly. So I wonder what was the story behind this? Did he like get the shard and then like a thing start controlling his back or what? Like, Link, you did it. It's a fourth shard. To end. Now we have all of them. Hey, Link. The words of the sages. Do you remember them? Only the true ruler of the twilight can destroy the mirror of twilight. Sai can only break the mirror of twilight into shards. He couldn't utterly shatter it. That's proof of his false kingship. It's true. It's gotta be some divine power that way. Think we have to hurry. To the mirror chamber. After all, a fake is a fake. And 
no matter how much you dress it up, the real thing always wins. I hope she's not saying that towards me. That'd be kind of awkward. I'm just gonna grab this uh, heart container. Oh, look at that! It almost got full double stacks. You try to catch it. Uh, yeah, we, we can leave. I feel like reading that. I just want to make sure if it was anything important or anything like that. All right. All right. Well, that was it. What the heck, there's another chest? What was the name of another chest? Guess they don't want me to have it. Well, I'm gonna try and get this chest. Whether you like it or not. And, uh... I'm gonna start signing out now, just so that I can save myself some time. So now that we have all of the shards of the twilight here we can now go back to the arbiter grounds and uh, check out what that's all about yes I know I'm not wearing uh, my Zora armor but I don't care oh water bombs why okay Quite possibly one of the most useless things I've gotten out of that dungeon. Oh well. So that's what we'll do in the next part, guys. We're gonna head back over. Well, that ain't true. Now that I have. Oh jeez. Now that I have a the double claw shot, I wanna do a bit of exploring around and grab things that we couldn't get before without the double claw shot. So, that's what we'll do in the next part, guys. Good win. So until then, you guys, this is Solar Primal signing out. And. Bye for now.